I'm Robert, and this is Charlie. Hi. And he recently upgraded from a factory stereo system in his car to a really nice aftermarket system. And I asked him out today to tell us a little about it. Well, I bought this car a couple of years ago, and I soon became very unhappy with the uh, Infinity sound system that comes in this thing. It just didn't cut it when you had the top down and you're driving down the road. Uh, you know, I think a lot of the rules that you follow when you're putting a system in a normal car go out the window with a, with a convertible because of road noise. You got, whether the top's okay. up or down, there's a lot of noise going on. Mm -hmm. And um, I feel like it's more important to get the mid-range and the bass out. And to do that, you need subwoofers and you need a lot of cone area in your speakers to get that, that mid-range that you need to sound full when you're driving 50 with the top down. When you were ready to do it a couple of weeks ago, we were able to bring in a couple of our pro installers who really know what they're doing when they're tearing cars apart, and they helped out a lot. And the beginning is this. It's the Eclipse CD7200 Mark II, and it's like the Rolls Royce of car receivers. It's sheathed in copper to keep the uh, okay. electrical noise out of your system, and uh, it's got three eight volt preamp outputs. Eight volt. Eight so volt. That's plenty of strong, clear signal feeding into the outboard amplifier. It's, it's ready to hurt the outboard <laughs> amplifier. <laughs> well, I don't think you're gonna hurt this Boston acoustic amp. Well, first of all, before we go to, go to the Boston amplifier, we're going to this audio control unit here, the DQ okay. XS. This end, it's a digital EQ. Uh, it looks pretty simple, but it's got awesome uh, equalization capability. Yeah, it can do a lot. These controls uh, access this little screen here and, you, and they're all multifunction controls. So you can really zero in on getting the sound right for your car. So out of the Eclipse into the audio control, then from the audio control to this Boston Acoustics <laughs> some help with GT50, which is a five channel amp, four by 50, running the front speakers and then a uh, 400 watt mono uh, subsection that's going to run the two eight inch subs. All right, so what are, what's the speaker arrangement? We're choosing these Boston S35 three and a half big honking magnets on them. These things weigh a ton. They're pretty heavy. They'll go up in the dash and in the front doors, these Boston SX95s, with little neodymium magnets here. Uh, these will be the front door speakers. Okay. And then and in then the rear six by nine slots, we're going to attempt to fit these big honk and Boston eight inch subs. Now, there is a second subwoofer going in yeah. too, but right now it's out in the shop uh, being fitted for a custom bracket. And theoretically, all hell is going to break loose. <laughs> now, if you'd like to learn more about the products Charlie has in his system, look him up in our customer car showroom at crutchfield.com slash charlie car. I like it. And if you want to learn what will fit in your car, go to crutchfield.com slash what fits or just call one of our advisors. They're at 1-800-555-9408. Right, right.